Hey guys, hey everyone, this is Mr. Rockstar with Android Tech Heroes here doing another ROM review for the Galaxy Note i717. Um, this ROM we're actually doing is for the Collective. It's the 10 2012 uh, CP 4.1 version, uh, 4.1.2 uh, Jelly Bean newest version. I'm booting it up, letting you see how it looks. It's got a cool boot animation. I actually really, really enjoy that. Uh, looks really, really uh, professional, awesome. They did a great job on that. Uh, why it's booting? <coughs> First and foremost, I want to thank uh, CyanogenMon for um, you know doing the base stuff, and uh, they're just they're just great with this kind of work. Um, uh, next, I want to thank Liquid Smooth. Um, if you've seen my other review, um, I did one for Mantle for Scout for Life, and that one was called Liquid Smooth. And Liquid Smooth um, helped them do the prop monitor source on this, so you're going to see a lot of things that are the same if you watched my other video. But um, as for ROMs um, that go, this has got quite a bit, a lot of uh, differences. Um, I also want to thank um, the whole collective team. Uh, Dman3285 for uh, spending so much time setting up the source. Uh, Ruger94 and Fezzi102 for compiling AV the APKs in one. Um, uh, EE23HD2 for theming and providing apps. Uh, and then, um, of course, last but not least, Flapjacks for his um, kernel, which is actually now in line with the ROM. So now when you flash this ROM you will have the flapjacks kernel so um, you can overclock it which is definitely recommended um, all the way up to 1.836 as you can tell mine right now is at 1.836 so when you first start this um, start this up you saw the boot up animation this is practically what it's going to look like after flashing it um, I added this and um, I think this is there when you do it but I added my calendar and I added my the you know these two things but as for that you get this really cool background and everything has got an orange theme to it so it's really cool it's AOCP which stands for Android Open Collective Project and, and if you look really closely at this you can see um, this this wallpaper is actually a live wallpaper you can see this moving really slowly right there. Um, you get the collective sign moving. It's kind of like a, an eagle moving up and down. It's really cool. Um, it's, a, it's, it's, it's pretty nice. I'm going to try to keep this as, as short as possible so that way everybody gets what they want. They get uh, you know the cool full ROM review and um, it's not 12 minute videos like my other ones. So let's do this pretty quick. So what's new? Well, uh, before we get to that, um, this is a 4.1.2 version now. Uh, they had a CP4 version um, updated up on 10-2012 uh, um, some, some days back, but now there's a CP4.1 version, and you'll find that at the top of the OP. It's the first thing to download. Um, what they did is they've, they've rooted, deodexed, um, they've got OTAs, uh, lots of custom customizations, custom apps, new features, wallpapers, and what they call the hip hip shiz. <laughs> it's really funny. Um, the change log for this is they fixed for um, they they have fixed force closing in the uh, personalized section and uh, personalized section. Uh, ascending alarm tone in desktop desk clock is also changed. App widget picker is included. Um, uh, the kernel sources from flat jacks is now finally compiled in line with this ROM which I told you so now you you don't have to download or flash um, a, a kernel to overclock it you just flash this ROM and it is now oh, it can it's overclocked um, with Flapjax's hotcakes kernel um, which is an awesome ROM by the way I love it it makes this uh, it makes this when you overclock this ROM it makes it absolutely awesome I'm gonna go through this real quick like see I mean everything is is fast and on the dot I mean it's really really cool you can even add cool clock version like that it's really cool I did this one but um, 
<clears throat> other things like framework has been done since the uh, 4.1.1 um, version. Uh, lots of additional modification options and personalized options, which we're about to get into. Um, like I said, overclocking is encouraged in this ROM. It helps it get really, really awesome. Most of the issues have been all fixed. I'm telling you, this ROM is flying now. There's, there is no, absolutely nothing wrong with this ROM. Um, you will not get any reboots. Uh, I'm going to go through the issues real quick so that way you know. Um, the MMS quick reply settings is when someone, uh, when it's off and someone sends you messages and it pops up and it says call back or quick reply that quick reply has been fixed so that way you can send the quick reply um aspire sometimes which is the uh one of the um home screen things um uh, it seems that the widgets disappear from the home screen and it's unpredictable uh and you would, would just replace it that's all been fixed uh the camera and panoramic mode has um crashed but now it has been fixed as well so um, there's really nothing wrong with this ROM other than um, you might get a reboot if you do and it's during a phone call all you have to do and you lose audio all you have to do is simply reflash the build without a factory data reset and it will bring it back but I have not experienced that ROM and I've been running this for about a week to two weeks now how to install it um, you can use TWRP or CWM, which is Clockwork Mod and Twerp. I like Clockwork Mod a little bit better. That's why um, I've been using it a little bit longer. So, um, and how do you do that? Is you factory data reset. Um, you download. Well, before you do all that, you download um, the C. P4.1 version and then you download uh, the gaps and you'll find that all in the OP and collective um, uh, the collective OP um, you'll factory data reset you'll wipe Dalvik format your system install um, uh, the zip from whatever you did the internal SD card or your external SD card wherever you put it uh, the collective um, 4.1.2 Download that, and flash it, and then you'll flash your gaps. Boot up, enter your enter your Google information, and then you in as they say, as the collective say, enjoy while resisting the urge to slap your mama. <laughs> That's got to be the best. They got sense of humor, so you got to give it up to these guys. I um I love the ROM, and of course, like I just uh, said, you get the orange theme. You get the orange um keyboard you get the orange messaging the orange the orange calling um you get the orange dialing system if i were to go to uh messaging or not messaging i'm sorry um call list see how everybody is orange that's really cool um i love that and what's even better is I'm about to get into personalization. So we'll go ahead and do that since uh, this is already at eight minutes. Okay, so um, first and foremost, um, you know, I did I, I did want to thank Ruger and Fezzi and all them and the collective team and Team Games, CyanogenMod Mod for paving the way for all this and for the collective team for bringing this over to us. Um, I, I love it. Um, and not only have they brought it over to us, but they brought it over to the Captivate and Fuse 4G, the Skyrocket, and of course the Note. They're working on it for the Galaxy S3 as well as the HTC. So if you have any of those phones or have any of friends that have those phones, be sure to tell them that um, this is either there uh, and they have the ROM or it's coming. And they should be excited because this is an awesome ROM, awesome ROM. Okay, so let's get down to it. When you go to your personalizations and you go to system settings, um, let me make my uh, font bigger for you guys so that way you can see everything. Okay. The personalization here is the thing that sets this apart from the liquid smooth version from Mano 4 Scout for Life. Um, collective, uh, the collective team has added OTA updates, which is 
the bomb. Instead of having to go to XDA or get on your computer all the time, you can look at your change log right here, see what has changed um, from everything. Look at this. They, they oh look right here. They even got a new update. Looks like uh, 1024. I did not know that. Um, this is for the i717 as well. Wow. So there we go. Um, I have not downloaded that yet but you should download it it is um, C4.2 uh, for the i717 that is awesome so after doing this I am gonna have to download that um, and it's probably got even more awesome update fixes but um, that's that's what's cool about this <laughs> you don't have to get online now you can just do the change log right there we got ROM downloads which you will of course easily down download your ROMs look at that that's funny <laughs> it says party hard. This guy's hitting his head on the bed. But you can get all your versions right here, all your downloaded versions. This is really cool. AOC, uh, or AOCP C, uh, CP 4.2. You can get download all that kind of stuff. This is, these are just different um, downloaded versions. And it's even got the instructions on how to download and it. Um, that's why I love Collective. This is awesome. Um, out downloads. This is they added all kinds of cool stuff. You got like Google. You got your Google um, um, apps right here. Your gaps. The Apollo. You even get the net. The Netflix. That's 1.8 full rotation black. So when you're watching it, you can actually watch um, Netflix standing up like this instead of having it in tablet mode like that. But you can also move this into tablet mode, and we'll go. We'll get into that in just a minute. Um, other than the OT updates, you can download new keyboards instead of having that those orange keyboards. You can do swipe keyboards to give you that or this color, um, all kinds of cool stuff like that, or even green or even different different colors. That's cool. So uh, the Collector ROM has definitely put a lot of hard work into this, and I mean this is really really cool to have this in your all um, you know in your in your thing. You get wallpapers, and I'll show you all kinds of cool wallpapers right here, right here. Check this out. They added these wallpapers as well. Um, some headphones. Look at that. I mean, these are some really cool wallpapers. Other than that wallpaper that came when you first flashed it, got some headphones right there. Even Hello Kitty. Um, even when uh, this one that you just flashed the live wallpaper where it has the it has them floating up. That's just so cool. The orange things up here. Look at that. You get the orange clock. The orange. Um, uh, battery percentage in there the orange bar that tells you it's the AOKP -OK kind thing where as the battery goes down it goes to the middle and as the clock as the um, battery runs down and it gets to the middle and it, it, it'll it'll go away that means your battery's down um, the toggles you can change the different toggles you have instead of having this type of toggle right here like I have and you can add those in um, make what kind of toggle order you want you can do the toggles which have um, uh, like the tablet kind like I'll show you like lock screen or I'm sorry go to toggles and you can actually change it to something like this that's cool I mean just like a tablet all kinds of cool stuff and since we're in toggles um, you can do any kind of color. You can disable any kind of color. You can do the brightness location, which I do on top, so that way when you bring it down, you can see your brightness and, and change it. All kinds of cool stuff. You can do the toggle order and enable which toggles you want um, on there. Um, the clock, you can do the clock color. You can do the clock style, which I said. Um, if you want the clock in this, if you want the clock in the center, if you want it on the right, or if you want it on the left, or even no clock, you can make sure there's um, AM, PM, or no AM or PM, or any day of the week. Um, uh, stuff like that. Um, the battery is the exact same thing. This is really cool. The battery icon, they even put, um, it's the same as kind of like a, as liquid smooth as the other one, but this is what Collective Mod did even further. They added their own little cool um, battery icon, which is called the Collective Mod icon, which you get this little bird up here, and when the bird um, pretty much dissipates and goes transparent your battery's dead so as it train as it goes transparent your battery dies love that icon and you can choose to um, 
uh, a battery icon will show up where the clear button shows up. So you can add all kinds of cool stuff. The battery bar location, I put it in the status bar just because that's where I like it, but you can change that. You can do the charging animation, which when you put the charger in it, you'll get these dots that come into your um, your big bar right here, and you can even change this, uh, the color of the bar and the bar thickness. See how thick it is right now? If I put it to one, it goes really small. So <laughs> that's cool. But uh, look at all this. Uh, look at all these customizations. You get LED option customizations, sound customizations, weather customizations, vibrations. You can even do your own type of vibrating. All kinds of cool things. Even your performance, which is like I said, it's, since it's it's um, it's been inlined with Flapjacks hotcakes, goes all the way to one pin eight three six. You don't have to download a set CPU or. Um, voltage or something like that to do it you got it all everything you need in this ROM is right here everything uh, the lock screen options of course you can add all kinds of cool stuff everything is customized by color it's all it all comes customized as orange but you can of course change that um, you can do uh, music in there on your uh, lock screen you can do weather you can do calendar you can do all kinds of cool stuff and look at this when I go to my lock screen which I've already um, done um, I've got my, of course, you get your Google lock camera, and then, of course, you go go to your Google up there. I get my weather, and then right here, it, every three seconds, which you can change, it tells me um, my like what, what kind of stuff I have, my calendar day. So I've, tomorrow i got a DA meeting. Um, i got a Halloween for Wednesday. Uh, that DA meeting is for something that we won't go into. Nothing bad, though, but um, I got pretty much uh, not in trouble but I found someone who did get in trouble and I was a witness so I get to go to uh, take the bench yay serve my country or my state but anyway uh, there's there it is you can even do your carrier label and change it and I changed mine to Antoy Android Tech Heroes instead of it saying AT&T this ROM's awesome guys I hope you enjoyed this review um, I, I again strongly encourage you to get this um, the collective version 10 2012 cp 4.1 is what this is but it, i guess there has been an update so check out the cp cp 4.2 update as soon as you download this um check out this rom the orange theme is cool uh i love it i totally would recommend it from these guys the collective team is a awesome team they worked really 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 hard and um you should guys should give them all credit all dues i would even do some donations if you can and then after you're done with them please come over here to my uh, my settings i work really hard on doing these reviews for these guys uh comment below if you have any questions i can answer them or um, if i don't know the answer to i will find it out for you hit the like button subscribe to my channel um, i do all kinds of reviews and tutorials and um we'll go from there so um, let me go ahead quick really and show you about the phone uh, there's 4.12 right there and then you got your hotcakes kernel already in there here's your build uh, and the build number it's the collective product jelly bean if you click it five times you get the jelly bean woo jelly bean hold it down bam done so go ahead and subscribe to my channel and um, I hope you guys really like this this is the full review of the collective ROM uh, AOC, or AOCP Android Open Collective Project. Uh, this is Mr. Rockstar for Android Tech Heroes signing off. Thanks guys. Uh, comments, questions, anything like that, let me know and subscribe. Have a good one.